Today, Melvin, Melvin is, going is going to be, to be killing, killing a lot, lot of people. people. So the idea of this video is we have the Orc Nation over here, and we're going to be trying to level up Melvin and get him the best gear so that... He can kill all of them. Oh, Melvin already had a son? What the heck? Marecho? Alright, you'll be named Melvin Jr. Actually, I don't think we've even named Melvin yet. Yeah. <laughs> His name is still Edich. I'm sorry. I don't, I don't care, care what your, your parents, parents named you. You're, you're going to be, be named, named Melvin. Melvin. Um, so first off, we're just going to give him a few traits to help him out. Um, so maybe like giant, tough, strong, uh, blessed, and then regeneration, genius. Um, yeah, we'll make him sexy. <laughs> sexy Melvin. Uh, fast, agile, and maybe we'll make him fireproof <laughs> just in case. All right, perfect. And then maybe we'll give him like a stick or something. Oh, can you not? Can you not give him sticks? Uh, I guess we'll just give him a, a wood spear. It's close enough. Oh yeah, it's just like that's literally just a stick. Oh, he had another son. Here, you don't deserve a name because we only care about Melvin Jr. <laughs> you can just have an underscore for a name. All right, firstly, we should just kind of gauge his abilities. Maybe we'll spawn him like a little hyena. See if he can beat a hyena. All right, nice. So he can beat a hyena. <laughs> But can he beat two hyenas? See how he does against two of them. Okay, yeah. We can definitely spawn some harder enemies. Maybe we'll give him like a bear or something. See how he handles a bear. <laughs> this might go terribly. This bears attack like so fast. Oh, Melvin Jr.'s all grown up. And somehow he already lost an eye. Despite only being eight years old. Alright, so Melvin is level two. So he's got 33 damage, 3% armor. 12% critical hit and 300 health now. Right, what should we do next? Maybe like a crocodile? I'm not sure if those are stronger than bears or not. 30 damage, that's pretty... That's a lot, but they only have one attack speed. So we'll see. Where are you going? You have to go kill Melvin. Go over here. Oh yeah, he attacks so slow. Yeah, Melvin, Melvin can destroy that guy easy. So one of the rules for this video is we can't really give Melvin any gear. He has to earn it. So let's, uh, let's spawn some skeletons. So hopefully you can get some better stuff. So it looks like these guys have some pretty good stuff. So he's got a steel ugly spear. <laughs> okay, Melvin could, could get some good loot out of this. Oh, even the monkey's joining in. Come on, monkey. Oh, I guess Melvin already killed all of them. And I guess he looted a steel bow. All right, let's do something fun. Let's uh, let's see if we can beat a giant chicken. Chickens are already a little bit weak, even being titan sized. So maybe we'll bless him and we'll give him the strong and tough perk. Come on, Melvin, destroy the chicken. <laughs> Oh, even Melvin Jr. is helping out. Okay, Melvin has ended Ba. So he's still level 2. Maybe a giant bear? Is that too much? How about a giant crocodile? Uh, I don't know about that, actually. Maybe just a regular giant one. Maybe, like, giant will give him some extra perks to make him harder. Yeah, he's got 49 damage. Should be a good challenge for Melvin. <laughs> All right, go, Melvin. Oh. <laughs> is the wildlife just going to kill him? Oh, no! Melvin Jr. just got killed. Oh, and Melvin just got a level up. So he's level 3, so he's got 340 health and 43 damage. Alright, let's spawn him like a few bears. Oh, I don't know. This is this kind of scares me. Maybe we should save this real quick. Okay, let's, let's back him up so he gets a, at least a little bit of range on them. And we'll just kind of save that real quick. Alright, go Melvin. Protect your children. Your, <laughs> your children are getting slaughtered. Oh, okay. Killed one of the bears. So he's got two bears left, um, one bear left. Oh, it's going to be so close. If the bear hits him twice, then he's dead. And he had 18 health left. Man, he that was so close. We'll heal him up real quick, and maybe we'll just spawn like three cold ones. Shoot them, you fool. Okay, there we go. So you got one down, two down, and number three. He literally just doesn't even care. Here, come over here. There we go. All right, now let's do like a bunch of snowmen or something. Some of them with some range. Oh crap, I forgot I had fast spawn on. I don't know how many are in there. <laughs> Hopefully Melvin can take them. All right, well, looks like they're just distracted by the house, so Melvin doesn't even have to worry about them. All right, let's do some wolves next. All right, go Melvin. You got this. Yes, they're distracted by your children. Now's your chance. <laughs> All right, nice, he killed them. So I think he's level, yeah, he's level four. Almost level five. So he's getting up there. I would really like to get him like a fire sword or something. <laughs> But I don't know if he can beat a demon yet. I'm kind of scared. All right, maybe we'll see if he can beat, like, four rhinos. Let's go, boy. Oh, <laughs> they're just all distracted by his children. All right, here we go. They noticed him. Oh, yeah, he's got two rhinos attacking him now. Come on, Melvin, you can do it. Destroy them. Dang, he's level five already? So he's got 
45 damage, 420 health. All right, let's check on the Orc Nation. So dang, they've gotten huge. They're starting to develop armies. Um, and they've pretty much captured this entire island. Um, they have, they just have to fill up this little space up here and then like down here. <laughs> so we definitely need to get Melvin leveled up quick if we're gonna be able to fight these guys. Cause yeah, they have 634 population and uh, 58 army. <laughs> All right, Melvin. You have to train harder than you ever have before. All right, what's something fun? We just do a giant buffalo or something. How overpowered are buffalo? The 18 damage. <laughs> what will it be if we give him? Dang, 54 damage. Okay, but he's got one attack speed. Should we? <laughs> should we risk it? We can save before this, but <laughs> I really just want to see Melvin destroy a giant buffalo. I feel like, I feel that, like that would make, make my, my day. day you, know? you know. Hopefully, he'll be distracted by like a tent or something <laughs> or yeah he's distracted by the monkey nice okay yeah melvin's doing a ton of damage without the guy even attacking him <laughs> oh and here comes the crab crab's gonna destroy the giant buffalo okay buffalo's down to 220 so i think melvin could take him thankfully he was just pretty distracted the whole time uh yep and he's down all right let's kill clear out some of these trees <laughs> just so we can see let's do like a giant rat rat king Okay, Rat King's got five damage. So we'll do a Titan-sized Rat King. And let's do like a bunch of little rats. Although hopefully they don't just spread the plague. <laughs> I feel like they probably will. Oh yeah, I guess if we make the Rat King mad, he just kills all of his babies. <laughs> so that's not going to work. Maybe we'll give Melvin like a, a cyber core to deal with. Oh, and Melvin's level six. <laughs> He's got 27 children now. What the heck? How does he have so many? That just shows how many of them died. <laughs> like 15 of them died. All right, this is pretty good for Melvin. He's just getting like a constant flow of XP because they just keep spawning. Nice, almost level seven. All right, maybe at level eight, we'll have him fight a demon. I really just want to have him. Uh... Oh, I forgot we can spawn these things. <laughs> oh, this will be fun. Maybe we'll, we can give Melvin some ghosts to fight. Come on, Melvin, <laughs> slay the ghosts. Just hope they don't put a curse on him or something. How much damage do these... Oh, the, the ghosts are pretty weak. They do have a high armor, but they, they only do 7 damage. <laughs> Sweet. So he's level 7. He's got 500 health. Maybe we could give him at least some basic armor at this point. Uh, I know I said I wasn't going to help him out at all, but I remember there's not really any way for him to actually get armor. <laughs> so let's just give him, like, maybe silver armor just for now. Maybe when he gets to level 10, we can give him like adamantine or something. Okay, what have we not done? Um, I'm kind of scared. <laughs> kind of scared to do an alien. I feel like they're just going to kill him like, super easy, but... Oh! But if Melvin can kill him, then he'll get a blaster. I didn't even think about that. All right. Uh, oh, no. This might be very bad. Yeah, I don't think Melvin's ready for this. <laughs> we'll make the alien the orcs problem. Cool, so now maybe... <laughs> I wonder how much health the trees have can we make some of these trees come to life how much health did oh they're pretty overpowered okay maybe if we back melvin up a little bit <laughs> he can destroy them all right this is actually pretty easy for melvin the trees are so slow oh they're they're coming though come on melvin you got this all right it's just this little baby tree all right i'm gonna save this again um i think we're ready to have melvin fight a demon though i, I think, think it's, it's time. time so we'll go ahead and grab a demon um, we'll put him, like, over here so that Melvin has some range on him. But I really just want Melvin to get a fire sword. Oh, Melvin's got this. Come on, Melvi. Oh, it's so close. Oh, he's down to 213. Demon's down to 161. Oh, no, he just missed the shot. Oh, and he just got killed. All right, well, I'm glad we saved. That was extremely close, though. Melvin just needed, like, two more hits on the demon. All right, and they just elected Melvin as king, which is funny because it's literally, like, this entire town is just populated by his children. <laughs> so I don't, I don't know, know if it was, was really, really a fair, a fair election. election. So we just have one level to go. All right, should we try demon again? He does have a slight advantage now. We'll go and save this. Okay, demon's distracted by Melvin's son, <laughs> who we don't care about. Okay, nice. So Melvin got some good shots. Oh! <gasps> Oh, he just killed him. Nice. So Melvin's got the fire sword now. So he does almost 100 damage now. And 36% critical hit. What should we have him fight now? We could see if he could beat an evil mage. Because if he could beat that, then he can get a fire staff. 
And that would be very overpowered. So demons or uh, evil mages have 500 health and 16 damage, but I think that's 16 damage per fireball, and they shoot like 10 of them. Although it doesn't look like that's gonna be a problem. Oh, wait, what? Why didn't he pick up the fire staff? <laughs> it's gotta be better than the sword. All right, well maybe the alien blaster is better. <laughs> I think Melvin can probably beat this guy now. I'm still gonna save anyways, just because I don't want to lose any of our progress. All right, come on, Melvin. What are you doing? Come back, you coward. Go fight this man. Fight the alien. Oh, what the? What the? <laughs> uh, what just happened? I think the alien, like, killed himself and also killed Melvin. Oh, no, the alien's still alive. He's up here. Dang, okay. Aliens are overpowered. What the heck? But Melvin is almost level 10. Um, so if he can just ki kill, like, a few more things, I think we can get him there. I bet he could beat, like, two demons now. At least I hope so. <laughs> nice. Yeah, he could do that easy. So 152. We'll spawn just a few more demons. Okay, level 10. Yes, he's level 10. All right, so at this point, let's just max him out. We got him to level 10, so we can we can give him some adamantine armor. So I think um, he kind of already technically earned the evil staff. He just didn't pick it up. But I'm going to give him the evil staff um, just because I think it'll be a little more effective against the orcs because he can actually kill like more than one at a time. And now the moment you've all been waiting for. So we'll go ahead and grab Melvin and put him at the top of the orc space. So as it currently stands, orcs have almost 800 population and 140 army. And, and we'll, we'll see, see if, if Melvin, Melvin can, can kill, kill all of them. them. So, so far he's doing pretty good. They haven't even been able to get close to him. But the real test will be when the military shows up. All right, seven, four, three, two. Okay, there's one guy left. I think it's this guy. Okay, so first village down. So we can go ahead and move Melvin Melvin down to the next one. Um, this one actually has an army, so this might actually be kind of a challenge. <laughs> All right, here we go. <laughs> Melvin's just slaying everyone. He's down 384 health and... <laughs> Oh, he lit, he lit like a fly on fire. Nobody escapes Melvin's wrath. Not even insects. Man, where are these guys' army? They're just all chilling down here. Like, Melvin isn't just, like, roasting their children right now. <laughs> yeah, let's, let's move Melvin down. I, don't, I feel like this, I have a feeling this military is just not going to intervene unless we make them. All right, let's go two times speed. <laughs> what, what are you guys doing? You idiots. They have definitely advanced their weaponry, though. Looks like they have, uh copper stuff so this might actually be um kind of a challenge for melvin oh yeah here they come <laughs> oh no oh he just he just killed like all of them in one little little hit all right so that's another city down and then melvin's down here is at 462 health all right so og tops down to 55 oh shoot did melvin just die Dang. Well, I guess the orcs were doing a lot more damage than I thought they were. All right. Well, not to cheat this little bit, but I really just want to see people die. So let's spawn in Melvin Jr. And we'll just give him the uh, the demigod trait. Oh, you are in trouble now. That gives him 225 damage, 100% 100 armor, 150 critical hit, and 120 speed. <laughs> um, So I don't think there's any chance that they're going to be able to kill this man. And we'll give him... Oh, let's try, let's try an alien blaster. He might just end up killing himself, but that's okay. And we'll make this guy mad, and we'll heal him up real quick. All right, Melvin Jr., finish your father's work. All right, finish them off. <laughs> oh, dang, he just he killed, like, all of them in one hit. Let's go, Melvin Jr. And it's even crazier because every time he gets a level up, he gets, like, way more stuff. So now he's up to 750 damage and, like, almost 10,000 health. <laughs> Rip the orcs. They're not going to survive this. All right, so that, that town's pretty much finished off. We'll move on to the next. We just put them right in the middle. Watch them just explode everyone. They're actually, like, getting close to him and doing a lot of damage, though. I'm not sure. Yeah, he's down to 300 or 3,000 health. But he can still get levels up, so I don't know if it really matters. <laughs> Why is he... His targeting is, like, so weird. He keeps shooting, like, these people on the outside and not, like... These people that are punching him in the face. Yeah, orcs just do not stand a chance against him. He's so overpowered. All right, Zatog's down to 20. Um, 18, 17, 16, 14, 13, 12. All right, we can count that one as destroyed. We'll move him on and let's just drop some bombs on this. 
Goodbye. So there's just two orc nations left. Okay, we can slow this down again. Um, they do have this huge army over here, but I don't know if it's really gonna do anything. <laughs> yeah, they just got roasted. <laughs> I can't even, <laughs> I can't even see anything. There's so much fire. All right, Melvin's got one more left, and I think he's probably just gonna kill him pretty easy. Is there anything fun we can do for the last um thing? <laughs> we can see if we can beat him with his bare hands. It could be kind of funny. Yeah, can Melvin can Melvin destroy him with his bare hands? Okay, Gezgeg down to 40, 30, 3. Oh, it's just these two guys. Let's see, 2, 1, and they were just destroyed. Rip. All right, so we technically kind of cheated that one, but you know what? We had fun, and that's, that's all, that all that matters. matters. Anyways, um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a thumbs up, and I will see you next time. Bye. Bye.